Hello and welcome to this new series on electrical and computer engineering. Today you and I start on a journey into a land of wonders, the land of high tech, the land of electrical and computer engineering. Our first task along that road will be learning the language spoken in that land, the language that electrical engineers use all over the planet. It is a mathematical topological language. It is a language used to describe anything and everything in electrical engineering from the behavior internal per, uh, operation of an iPhone, a high definition plasma TV, uh, the automatic controls of an airplane, the power grid of a country, of a town, of your home, even your car, even a human body is represented using this language by electrical, biomedical engineers. As a matter of fact, any system that can be described by a set of coupled linear differential equations with constant coefficients can also be described with an advantage using this language. The name of that language, however, is a bit misleading. It's called Electric Circuit Theory, ECT. I'd even though that has a very strong historical value, it suggests something that is not the truth. It is used not only to describe electric circuits, far more than that. I assure you that. The power of ECT, Electric Circuit Theory, goes far beyond that of mere description of systems. It is used to analyze and to predict the behavior of systems in front of changing circumstances. In short, ECT is description, analysis, and prediction. Now let me share some good news with you. ECT has very few words in its vocabulary and even fewer syntax rules. It is simplicity, elegance, and power. Well, it's time now. Without further ado, let's begin.